Welcome everyone to another edition of One of Every Master's Set. I'm your host, Tragic, and we have a new player in town. Double Masters is out, so I've added it to the bunch, and you will notice that Modern Horizons is in there. And yes, it's not a master set, but... Hold on, I want to put this in order. Double Masters last. We'll do it like that. Uh, yes, it's not a master set, but I do it anyway. Get over it. Okay, first up, Masters 25. Get it in camera here. Let's go for the spiciness. Nice art on that. I don't know if I've ever seen that. Uh, we will just kind of breeze through the commons as we do here. Um, make sure the camera is not going to focus on Lily too much there. Let's get into these uncommons. Pillory of the Sleepless. Heavy Arbalest, Willbender, and a Doomsday. We got a Mythic there. For three black, it's a sorcery, search your library and graveyard for five cards, and exile the rest. Put the chosen cards on top of your library in any order. You lose half your life, round it up. Punishing, but man, I'll bet you could do some stuff with that. Let's scan this up with the scanner. We got a foil giant growth there too. Let's see if it is going to be worth anything. I might have to actually reset my scanner. Okay, the scanner's working fine. It just doesn't like that card. I had to enter it in manually. Doomsday is 10 bucks. Let's go. Mar Masters 2017. Let's get into this. The Web. Vampires. Sylvan Ranger. There we go with some uncommons. War Clan Rampager. Is it Signet? That's pretty decent. Unburial Rites and a Niv Mizzet Draco Genius. And we got a foil Dinrova Horror. Looks pretty cool. So good old Niv is uh, a 2, 2 blue, and 2 red for a legendary Dragon Wizard. He's 5 5 flying. Whenever Niv Mizzet Draco Genius deals damage to a player, you may draw a card. You can pay blue and red to make him deal 1 damage to target creature or player. Not a huge one, but uh, I think it's a solid card. It's been reprinted a few times. It's uh, going right there. All right. Next up, Iconic. A couple of good cards in this set. A couple of good cards in all these sets, honestly. Mutiny, Peel. Evolving Wild is a classic. Predation. Here we got a Lure. Wing Shards. Rift Bolt. Pretty good uncommon. And Thought Seize. Pretty good rare. There we go. Uh, I'm actually going to scan this Rift Bolt up real quick. And it's okay. Thought Seize, though, for one black. It's a sorcery. Target player reveals his or her hand. You choose a non land card from it. That player discards a card. You lose two life. Classic and a foil Burrington Forge Tender. Thought Seize Iconic Masters, 22 bucks. There's a hit. There we go. Alright, and the dragon. Alright, Modern Horizons. Goes this way. I kind of still feel that this is like a master set since it's mostly for modern. What do I know? Got an illusion. Got a uh, blind vampire there. Throat Seeker, that's what that is. Snow Covered Forest, and Ayula, Queen Among Bears. Pretty cool. For two, it's a legendary creature bear, it's a 2 2. Whenever another bear enters the battlefield under your control, choose one. Put two 1 1 counters on target bear. Where target bear you control fights target creature you don't control, it's a bear lord. What more do you want? You have a Feaster of Fools. Ayula is only 50 cents. Feaster Fools, Rebuild, and a Web Weaver Changeling. And some shenanigans. Alright, Eternal Masters is up next. There we go. Shelter. The Urborg Uprising. Man, what is going on with those? Oh, they're like spirits. Cool. <laughs> I was having trouble understanding that art. Glacial Wall. More art that I don't understand. What is going on there? getting bigger right seal flamekin zealot young pyromancer good uncommon jetting glass kite and eight and a half tails for two it's a legendary fox cleric two two 
You can pay one in a white target permanent you control gains protection from white until end of turn. Or you can pay one target spell or permanent becomes white until end of turn. And a foil sentinel spider. Eight and a half tails, a buck forty. And a young pyromancer. It has been reprinted again and again to pretty much 50 cents now. Alright, Ultimate Masters. Oh wait, this one's got this side jobby thing there that never works properly for me, so. There we go, Zombie. Terramorphic Expansion Foil. Might actually be kind of a little bit. And a Woodfall Primus. So, Terramorphic Expanse, which it did the wrong version and had a false positive. Let's see if the Ultimate Masters version, wow, it's been printed a bunch of times. The foil. 93 cents. Big winner there. Woodfall Primus. 257. Stream of Consciousness, Travel Preparations, and a Meringue River Prowler rounds it out. Faithless Looting. It's okay. Alright, Modern 2015. Pull them all out. Who's this guy? Got an Eldrazi spawn on the back. Some flames. Scuttling death. Flamekin. And Artisan of Kozilek. Shrewd Hatchling. Tumble Magnet. And the rare is a Blink Moth Nexus. To land, you can tap it to add one to your mana pool. Or you can pay one to make it become a 1 1. Blink Moth Artifact Creature with Flying until end of turn. It's still a land. Or you can pay one to give target Blink Moth Creature a 1 1 until end of turn. That's good. Wouldn't it be better if it had Infect? Like the Ink Moth Nexus would do. So I think that one's not a super big one. It's 350 or so. There we go. And a Plague Rusalka and Foil. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Alright. Modern Masters, the original. Nantuko, Changelings, Battlekins, Fungus, Zombies, Raven's Crime is a good common. Oops. Mike and Darren, Pepper Smoke, Uncommons, Etched Oracle, Stir the Pride, Trigon Predator, and Kataki Wars Mage. Alright, Legendary Creature Spirit for two. It's a 2 1. All artifacts have at the beginning of your upkeep sacrifice this artifact unless you pay one. Good anti artifact tech and a foil lava spike that's pretty solid, too. So, a couple bucks for that. Uh, the original version, I'm sure it's not too much different. And a foil lava spike can it be seen by the scanner? I have to add that in manually. Give me a second here. Well, we've been printed three times. That's actually. Did not know that. Four bucks or so, almost five. So that's a good one right there. And the Raven's Crime is not quite a dollar for the original. There we go. Okay, lastly, pack of double masters. So we get two rares and two foils out of this. Let's see how we do here. Aberration, Battle Rattle Shaman. There's his tower. I'll pull it. Surge Node, Glint Sleeve, Uncommons, Painsmith, Riddlesmith, Path to Exile, very good. Thespian Stage, mm, it is a rare. It's got a, it's a land, tap it to add or you pay to, and Thespian Stage becomes a copy of target land, except it has this ability. It's okay. And a Maze of If, pretty good card there too. Alright, let's scan these up. Thespian Stage, couple bucks. Maze of Ith, and then we got some foils, a Relic Runner. Double Masters, Maze of Ith, 892. Relic Runner as a foil, and a Death Hood Cobra. And that's going to do it for that. So, we'll do the Path to Exile. And the Urza's Tower. There we go. 6981 on that stack of cards. And uh, a couple good hits there. Always fun time to open up master sets and see what's inside.
Thanks for joining me today. Uh, make sure to like and subscribe. Tragic MDG. See you later.